Governor Wolf delivered his fifth state budget address this morning. It's his first since winning that second term. And while the governor has seen some intense battles over the budget during his time in office, his proposal today seemed to strike a tone of bipartisanship. Matt Heckel reports. Yeah, Governor Wolf today announcing his proposed budget for the 2019-2020 fiscal year, a $34 billion plan focused on the workforce and education. Governor Wolf on Tuesday wasted no time getting to what he hoped is the headline for his latest budget proposal. This proposal asks for no new taxes. The roughly $34 billion budget, a $927 million increase over the previous year, includes the creation of the new Statewide Workforce Education and Accountability Program, or SWEEP. It's the next step we can take together to build on all the work we've done over the past four years. The budget also calls for millions in investments in the state's agriculture industry and over $13 billion in investments toward education, including raising the start starting salary for teachers to $45,000. This could be a game changer for our schools, especially in our communities that are struggling to attract and retain the next generation of educators. The governor's budget also lowers the corporate net income tax rate for corporations doing business in PA to just under 6% by 2024. I think there is a lot there that we can uh, embrace and get behind, at least generically. Republican leaders in the House and Senate with a positive reaction to the the governor's budget proposal. Uh, we, we again share some of the goals. Obviously, there will be uh, differences in the details, uh, but we look forward to working out those differences uh, over the next few months. In Harrisburg, Matt Heckel, Jet 24 Action News.